Hi, today we're going to publish a book through Kindle Direct Publishing. Using this service, we can upload an ebook of our own and sell it to the masses. This is my book. It's been a dream of mine ever since I was little to be a published author. And through Amazon, I've become just that. I started this project in Google Docs. However, various options are available to you. Of course, there's Microsoft Word. The only real requirement is that you have a modern word processor that's able to save in a docx format. When you upload your book to Amazon, you're going to want it in a docx format. You can do that through Google Docs by going to File, Download as, docx. If you're working in Microsoft Word, that's the native file format. Now that the book is in the correct format, we're going to go to Kindle Direct Publishing, or KDP for short. Here, we're going to either sign in with our Amazon account or create a new one. After either signing in or creating a new account, Amazon will prompt you to fill in some more details in your profile. This includes things such as tax information and where to send royalties. Now that the boring details are filled in, be ready to begin publishing your book. After signing in, you'll be redirected to the bookshelf page. This is your new best friend. It lists all of the books you have published through the Amazon store, and this is also where you begin working on a new book. The process of publishing a book through Amazon is simple and easy. It walks you through the whole process step by step, but we begin by clicking on the Create New Title button on the bookshelf homepage. As you can see, there are two main steps. Step one, your book, and step two, rights and pricing. So to start off with, we need to enter some simple details about the book, such as the title. This particular book won't have a subtitle, and it's never been published through anyone besides Amazon, so the edition number and the publisher are entirely irrelevant. The description is more or less the blurb found on the back of most paperback books. So we'll enter a brief description of the book, and we'll also sign our name. I happen to be the author of this book. Next, some categorization is necessary. This is where we tell the audience what kind of book this is. This particular book happens to be fiction, and it's also dystopian. We also need to set up the age range and the grade range. Because this is a more mature, perhaps darker book, I'm going to set it to be pretty high. But that's entirely up to you. Next, we need to set up some keywords for the book. Next, Amazon gives us the option of making the book available for pre-order. However, if you're like me, you're excited to get your book out there. So I'm going to release it right now. I've created my own cover with an 8 to 5 ratio. The final step is to actually upload the docx that we downloaded earlier. After finishing up the details of your book and hitting save and continue, you're free to continue on to the next section of the process. In this section, you'll establish where you want your book published, either worldwide or in individual territories. You'll also set your pricing and royalties. I chose to publish this one for 99 cents, and because of that I had to choose the 35% royalty option. If you want to publish with the 70% royalty, the book must be between $2.99 and $9.99. You can scroll all the way to the bottom, agree to Amazon's terms and conditions, and click Save and Publish. While Amazon claims that it may take up to 48 hours to publish the book, look for your book in the next 4-5 to five hours. That's about how long it took me. 
Congratulations, you're now published. In conclusion, I recommend that anyone that has any kind of interest in the writing field in general looks into being published through Amazon.